The best microphone for gaming, streaming, and podcasting is a growing necessity for the modern gamer. Whether you aspire to stream your gameplay, engage in intense Discord conversations with friends, or finally record that podcast, these top-tier microphones will make you sound your best. The best microphone we recommend right now is the Shure MV7, a hybrid USB slash XLR microphone that gives you the best of both USB's convenience and XLR's quality, if you don't mind dropping a bit of coin. If you want to spend less, the Razer Siren Mini is currently our best budget microphone for less than $50. It might lack some features, but it makes it up for it in sound quality and price. Achieving studio quality sound with your streaming gear doesn't require an advanced degree in sound engineering, though it might help. In most cases, all you need is a USB port and some engaging content to discuss when you go live. To help you find the right model, we've listed the best gaming microphones 2024 and their key features, plus the things you need to consider to help you choose the best one for you, and as always you can check pricing for any of these products in the description below. Like the video, comment, and don't forget to subscribe. Now let's get started. Number 6 Shure MV7 Podcast Microphone if you're a musician or want your voice to sound the way it's meant to be heard, the MV7 is an easy recommendation and our choice for the best microphone overall. That's if you don't mind reaching deep into your pocketbook, of course. There are much more affordable mix on this list, but it's still absolutely true that if you want the best, you will have to pay for it. You don't really need to be much of a sound person to know Shure makes killer audio gear. Chances are you've seen some of your favorite musicians rock a Shure microphone on stage or in the studio. Shure has been providing pro-grade microphones for an age, and the MV7 podcast microphone is its attempt to bring its high-end sound to content creators. The USB Type-B Micro slash XLR connection will be the big draw for a lot of folks. It gives you the best of both worlds by providing the adaptability of XLR, especially if you use professional audio interfaces, and the versatility of Type-B micro inputs for recording on the go with laptops and mobile devices. Shure's first hybrid XLR slash USB microphone manages to provide pro-grade sound with minimal setup and expertise. While it is more expensive than your average premium mic, its versatility completely justifies the cost. It's hands down one of the best microphones I've used for recording. Number 5. Razer Seren Mini the Razer Sierra Mini is our top budget microphone for streaming, and at just $50, it might skimp on features but still delivers top-notch sound. If you're just looking to switch from a headset mic to a better sounding desktop mic but don't want to have to mess around setting it up, the Sierra Mini is as plug-and-play as it gets. The Sierra Mini's adorable pill-shaped design comes in your choice of black, mercury white, and quartz, pink. Out of the budget mix out there, the Sierra Mini's design is the most eye-catching. I was set a mercury white microphone and it's one of my favorite looking pieces of hardware I've gotten this year and pretty darn cute. If your aesthetics lean a little more towards the RGB however, it may well be worth taking a look at the Hypercast Quadcast X down below. Many features were stripped away from the Saren Mini to keep the sound quality up and the cost down. There's no volume or gain dial or even a mute button. It's bare bones as they come, but for $50 it's to be expected. The proprietary micro USB cable Razer tends to use on many peripherals is a bit of a pain. It keeps you from using third-party cables because they simply won't fit. I can't express enough how much I hate when a hardware company does this. If you lose that cable for whatever reason, which happens, the mic is useless until Razer's replacement arrives. Number 4 Audio-Technica 2020 USB Plus The Audio-Technica 2020 USB Plus makes our list as the best mid-range microphone, but honestly, it's cheap enough that it could make our best budget pick as well if the Razer Siren Mini above wasn't so darn affordable. Retailing for under $100, and often found for around $70. The AT2020 USB Plus makes very few compromises where it really counts, and that's the great sound. Inside that tough and resilient metal body lurks an excellent capsule that picks up all the crisp notes in your voice while maintaining a warmth that belies its diminutive price tag. It sounds absolutely great, and really that should come as no surprise to those familiar with their audio equipment. Audio-Technica is a brand famous for creating some of the most accurate, well-built, and studio-ready sonic equipment, so even on its more mid-range to budget offerings, it's flat-out refused to compromise on the thing that really counts, and that's the audio pickup. It's maybe a little plosive, which means puh sounds can become blown out, but pop filters are cheap, and given it's a condenser mic, you could always adjust your distance and up the gain a bit to compensate if you're using decent background noise removal plugins. Number 3 Sennheiser Profile Streaming Set the Sennheiser Profile Streaming Set gives you everything you need to start your podcasting or streaming journey with a great-sounding microphone and sturdy boom arm combo for less than $200, which makes it our top recommendation for the best USB microphone and boom bundle. The Profile has two versions. 
the standalone microphone for $129 or the streaming set for $199. We'll take the latter thanks as it's a great deal for a full set that means you have everything you realistically need for great studio quality audio. The profile has a heavy duty metal casing and a flashy design that you wouldn't necessarily associate with Sennheiser as a brand. I know if you're looking at those photos and thinking it doesn't look all that, but in person it's really quite a handsome looking mic and would look suitably professional yet also slightly flash on your stream cam. The volume and mix controls are well placed, and the dedicated mute button is one of those features you probably wouldn't care much about on paper, but makes all the difference in practice. Having a physical button to ensure you're muted helps avoid any awkward streaming audio-related accidents. No mom, I know dinner's ready. Can't you see I'm recording games for the internet over here? Number 2 HyperX Quadcast S The gamer-centric HyperX Quadcast S is an excellent microphone for the gamer or streamer, looking for an easy-to-use, clear-sounding mic and takes our top spot for the best-looking mic. Might seem a bit strange to think about looks when buying a microphone, but if you've got your audio gear in shot, it'd be nice if it looked great as well as sounding it, don't you think? The biggest draw of the Quadcast S beyond its good looks is that it's loaded with built-in features that usually end up being pricey add-ons for other streaming microphones. The built-in shock mount prevents the mic from picking up any accidental bumps that happen during a contentious Warzone match or overly active Discord chat. The built-in pop filter is also a nice touch considering I always have issues trying to find the optimal position and distance for my Rinkadink $7 pop shield, and it never quite stays where it's supposed to when mounted. The touch-sensitive mute button at the top of the microphone is excellent too. Often mute buttons and switches make a loud click when recording. This doesn't. The Quadcast S hits the sweet spot of price, sound, and features if you're looking to add something to your live stream. Number 1. SteelSeries Alias Pro Setting up a stream with great audio is traditionally not easy, which is the reason we're sticking the SteelSeries Alias Pro in as our best microphone for streaming. It might be pricey, but what you're paying for here is really the stream mixer that comes with it, and all the streamer-friendly features that make it a fantastic buy, even if it is pricey at a $330 slash £330 MSRP. That little two-dial, two-button unit contains a powerful preamp that can connect out to an XLR microphone with 48V phantom power, which means you can use this with just about any other good XLR mic on the market. However, SteelSeries has provided you with one of its alias units here, and thankfully, it's a bit of a peach. It sounds lovely, particularly close up with a bit of an adjustment, although we'll get to that later. Once you've booted up the Sonar software, you'll discover that it takes away most of the strain of setting up a load of complicated inputs, outputs, and audio gear. Drop-down menus and great hardware slash software discovery means that this package does its best to make all those confusing settings as straightforward as possible, and the RGB lit buttons and dials on the front of the interface can be programmed in a variety of ways to make streaming control easy, straightforward, and right beneath your fingertips.